Well, praise the Lord again, everybody. Amen. This is Apostle Houston. Amen. Back with you live again. Amen. Part two of Life with Apostle Houston. Amen. Well, as you can see, this is my kitchen. You can see, I can tell I do a little something, something in my kitchen. Hallelujah. Amen. This is my nice little kitchen. Amen. Yes. Alright. You see my kitchen. See my little decorations over there, huh? Okay. Praise God. <coughs> Hallelujah. Amen. God is worthy to be praised. Amen. Too. We thank God for His power. We thank God for His grace. And we thank God that this is the day that the Lord has made, and we will rejoice and be glad in it. Amen. We know that God is still sitting on the throne. We know that God still answers prayers. Amen. We know that God answered by fire. Amen. We know that God is a miracle worker. Amen. We know God is a healer. Amen. We know God is a deliverer. We know God is your lawyer in your courtroom when you go through trials and tribulations, when you go through certain situations in your life. Amen. We know that God is able to see you through. Amen. Amen. When Neshach, Rashach, and Abednego, all them three Hebrew boys went into the fire furnace. Now, we understand that they, they did not want to buy it out to these false gods. They didn't want to buy down to this bunch of nonsense that was going on in this Babylonian system. Amen. But they made up their mind, amen, for God they live and for God they die. Amen. But they made up their mind, you know what, even though we go down this fire, even if we don't be delivered, but we know that God is able. See, they had the faith to believe that God was able to bring them out. See, right now you may be going through some trials and tribulations in your life. You may be going through some hard places in your life. You may be going through some things that you can't even understand in your life. And you know that God specializes in the impossibility which man cannot do. See, God specializes in the possibility to make it possible. See, with man it's impossible, but with God all things are possible. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen, amen. When God spoke to Moses and told Moses, Moses, I have seen the affliction of my people. He said, but I come down to deliver them. He said, I come down to set my people free. I come down because I heard their cry. I came down because I saw the affliction. I came down because I saw how they were being tormented and messed up. But I come down to show my mighty hand. I come down to show my mighty fist. I come down to show that I am God and I'm God alone. Come on, somebody. Oh, come on, give God some praise. Oh, you better come on, give God some praise. God said, I pray that you may have life.